Hello, and welcome back to Underrail. So I just killed off these mutants. They weren't really that tough. Mutees tend to be easier than the mutants. Because they're like... Half mutants. They're kind of like people, still. But I'm just looting them. They don't have a ton. They do have one thing in particular that I'm really looking for. Ooh, and some XP. Biocorp technology catalog fragment. A couple torn pages and illustrations from a technology catalog of the old Biocorp. This was obviously not meant to be a blueprint of their technology, but rather a commercial showcase. Oh yeah, there's mutant dogs over there. I should stock up on more shells. I'll go do that real quick. We got one more rat hound buff. That's it. We gotta go buy some food. Gunslinger back from work here. Oh, kinda. I wanna sell you more stuff. Really. Yeah, that seems fair. Go right back. There's a bunch of mutants over here, so... <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Not quite how it's looking for now.
delete my Discord server. Sorry about that. And also, sorry I've been talking during this combat. Ooh, that yell. Man. There we go. Killed all those mutants. We're totally out of Molotovs now. Oh no, we're not. We have one left. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think we're already done with all this stuff. Just in case. You never know. So inside here, there's a cabinet with cryonic, cryokinetic orb, which is a very good metathermic skill. And in my opinion, worth killing all these guys. I'm gonna take that, I'm gonna use it. Oh right, it doesn't appear, I have to use up my mind juice. But that wasn't that bad. We got a really good psi ability out of it. And we got a laser pistol, which we can sell, which is awesome. Get some more cash, we're already at 2,000 charons. Cash is just good for when you wanna, there's gonna be lots of times where you wanna buy things in this game. Like I honestly should be looking from Oscar to see if he wants to, if he has a shotgun frame to buy. Uh, Despo. It's 72 mechanics though. A skinny body, large head. A skinny body, large head. These are the first things to come to your mind after looking at this man. His aging skin is covered by simple, modest clothes. With only an ornamental, ornamented metal bracelet on his right hand standing out. Modest too is his smile, after which he speaks with a light, relaxed voice. I welcome you to my store, Traveler. Halim is my name. I am at your service. Let's see if we can go get your goods. Uh -huh. He wants our blueprints. How many blueprints does he want, too? You can have all that. He'll give me like all of his money. That's awesome. As you move closer to the woman who appears to be in her late 30s or 40s, or early 30s, 
You notice she is holding a scalpel in front of her face. Studying it with great concentration, she turns it around and observes it from every angle, occasionally touching the blade with her thin fingers and smiling. You wait quietly. You get no acknowledgement. It appears that this object mesmerizes her so much she's unaware of you being there. Excuse me, um, are you a doctor? She snaps out of her focused state and turns to you. Her expression turns neutral, and she smiles. Soon afterwards, she gives you a response, carried by a rich, high-pitched voice. Why, yes, I am. I have a coat. That makes me a doctor, doesn't it? Does it not? She cackles. I'm Dr. Gratz. Now, allow me to diagnose your illness straight away. That's why you're here, right? Hmm. Perforated eardrum? You have anything to trade? Um... I believe she'll give me focus sniff. Yep. Yeah. Ah, it's very good for me. Because that'll allow us to do crit damage. And cadet some of our inventory. Oh, we can make magnesium grenades, but we need uh, more chemistry. Cerebral hemorrhage? Uh, I'm just gonna buy some of your stuff. Um, I'm gonna buy five of these and five of these. How much is that? 63 coins? That's fine. Because we have a lot of Psy stuff. Psy inhalant. Create all that we can. Nice. So now I won't feel bad. This in my brain. Bam. Innervate. So that removes all of your psi and all of your reserves. So then you have to redo your thing. But now we have a new skill, which we can use. Which is basically a giant cold grenade. That's amazing. Actually, we want. Recycle that. Recycle item. Air kit. We're gonna make a bunch of these. Electronic repair kit. I don't think we have um, fabrics. 50. So I'm not going to worry about that. Alright. Our inventory is a lot lighter now. Got some Molotovs. Some HE grenades. That's all fine and dandy. Um, let's go down stairs. Because I need to go buy more rat hound stuff. Because we need it for our shotgun. We, we're not strong enough to pull the shotgun. Cry strength 5. I should have maybe spent a skill point on that, but I like doing more damage. You can always just eat this rat hound stuff. So at the metro, you've got Mo and a kitty. Hi, kitty. Something sure smells good. Well, look at that. It's Mo's food. Want some? I want to try something. Oh, he's not selling rat hound stuff. Unlucky. Well then. There's some more XP. Yeah, there should be a lot of XP around Core City. Nice. Let's go to... Hmm. Let's 
go to south gate. Let's just stay at south gate. Let's not explore. Let's just stick to core city for the time being. We won't go the other two places for a little bit. Let's go to commons. I see this silly rat hound stuff. Oh, aren't you a joker? Don't remember hearing your complaint before, so what do you need to order something? Um, Rat Hound Barbecue, too. That's fine enough for the time being. Cost us, like, 50 coins, because we're going to take the train back and forth, but whatever. Core City. That's why you save up your money. So we're going to go to the arena. Because the arena is a good place to make money. And to level up right off the bat. Because you get lots of stuff from the arena. All you do is talk to this guy. You approach, your approach transforms the man's sharply lined face to a dull expression, further emphasized by the drawn-out sigh that follows it. A big fellow lazily rises from behind the desk and greets you with a level of enthusiasm ready of implied first few seconds of your encounter. Even his initial words, which come after his scratched beard for a good few seconds, sound like they've just woken up stumbling over their way out. However. Already, the second sentence gets carried by a fully projected and articulate voice, fitting of a man of his stature. Here comes another one. Hey, welcome to the arena. Are you lost? Are you here to fight? I came here to fight. He nods. Good, good, good. I'm Sintar Lanista. I'm in charge of recruiting fighters and organizing matches. And your name is Sophia. Good. Now, I don't know. He scratches his head. Unless you've been living in the deep cabins or something like that, you should be familiar with how the arena works, right? Um, I'm going to skip it. Basically, it's just an arena. You fight everything. It's not that complicated. You know, all, most RPGs have an arena. Um, kill everything, basically. Good, good, he smiles. This is going to be quick. There's just one thing before you can start your match. Sign here. He places you a piece of paper. If you don't know how to write your whole name, just write X. Write Sophia. So, you know how to write your name after all. Congratulations, you're now a challenger. Ready for your first match? See you later. Okay, I'm going to save the game right here. And I'm gonna eat some right now. There it is. I'm ready for my first match. Good, you'll be f fighting some rat hounds with two other poor cha challengers. Two other challengers. Get you going. And we're back. All you bloodthirsty maniacs are about to witness another beautiful bloodshed. Today, we'll enjoy the fight between these three challengers and a pack of hungry rat hounds. Give us a bloodbath! So you always want to use your challengers as bait. And in fact, you always want to kill your challenge. Because you'll get their loot too. Good thing this guy is totally surrounded by rat hounds, which is amazing.
not show me where you are, my friend. Wow. How about this? I'm gonna zone you out. I'm sure you are. This guy's coming back. Okay. Bam. First one done. Those challengers came back. I thought the one guy was totally dead. As soon as we clean up this mess, we'll be moving on to the next event. Thank you. Alrighty. So we have no health. <laughs> we have a bunch of loot, though. Look at all this. Rat hound ears. Ancient rat hound tooth. Bam. That level. So we got some more medicine. We got a large waste basket. Nice. Whole bunch of goodies. Put these back on our bar. Oh. Here's our shotgun. Uh, recharge our shield generator. Do you want to extract all the stuff we got, especially that adrenaline, so that we can make more focus stem? Focus stem is very good. Makes you do more crit damage. see now. Guns, definitely. We're only level 7, so we're not going to have much. We want higher mechanics. Metathermics. Mercantile. We want a little bit better chemistry. So we can make better, like, molotovs and stuff. I forget what you need for bullhead, but now we have bullhead, so maybe that's kind of useful. I do want to put some points into hacking. I'll put a point in persuasion. I think that's fair. Good, good, and you survived. You're not halfway after all. Here's your reward, 50 Stygian coins. Also, everything on the loot locker right behind me is yours. Thanks, I'm ready for more. I'm sure you are. Ready for my next match. 
Like side beetles? Actually, I don't care. You're finding them anyways. We're back again. Can't, I'm sure you can't wait to see this slaughter. Does anyone say bugs? Because that's what our challenges have on the menu today. Or is it the other way around? He laughs. Give us a bloodbath. Uh oh. Why am I not going first? Too. The smell of burning insects always brings me back to the famous match where Death Ray obliterated 40 bugs with his arm flamers. I hope you enjoyed the event just as much as I have. We'll be back soon. Alright. Speaking of being back soon, I think that'll probably do it for this episode. Got through two matches of the arena and yeah look at that even more stuff to loot yeah there's gonna be crafting components in that locker much of this. Thank you for watching. Uh, in the next episode, we'll probably do a bunch of arena matches, because I really enjoy the arena, and I think it's a good way to level and earn money to start. So, yeah, that's probably what we'll do. Thanks again. See you next time.